Need to stand here and answer the questions. But now, what do you want to say about uh, this award, woman, uh, woman, for woman of worth? Uh, well, tonight uh, is a very, very important night in our calendar. I know it's a night where a lot of very important people come together and leave everything behind that they're working on um, to do something which to me is really, really important, and that is to highlight and give women recognition who are working on who are working on very, very important um, projects, important um, situations in life which often do not get highlighted at all. So I think tonight is really about um, trying to give recognition and to um, in some way acknowledge these women who are doing amazing, amazing work and work very tirelessly and oftentimes for you know little or no recognition at all. Any woman who inspired you? Um, I, there's always been uh, many women, but I think um, three women I could mention is um, one is Serena Williams, um, another one is Sheryl Sandberg, um, and I think Indira Gandhi, primarily because these are women who have left um, amazing marks in, um, in, in their areas of work, which have primarily been dominated by men. So I think these women are very inspirational to us. That's only because everyone's saying, please don't say your mom, because every, I think we all say, uh, of course, your, your mother is, I think, the first uh, woman we would all think, and I don't know if you were here last year, but last year my mom came with me. So um, I had actually called her up on stage because my mom has been doing for the last about 27 years um, charitable work. So for me, of course, when you say that my mom's name comes at the top of the list to number 10, not just for her charitable work, but um, also just for the, her attitude in life and her attitude of constant positivity and constantly instilling in us um, to never be afraid and to always, um, to always have hope and to have faith and to have belief. And I think that's also what tonight is about. It's about celebrating women who are spreading hope and belief in sometimes areas which um, can seem very desolate. She is recovering. She is recovering from uh, an operation she just had. She's doing well, but um, she has been advised to take it easy, which doesn't come naturally to her. So, we literally have to. We can all go through moments of feeling that, um, of feeling insecurities, of feeling uncertain, of feeling uh, not knowing what our place are, or what we want to do with our lives. And I think uh, what I would just say, not that I have all the answers, um, we should always know that we are enough. However we are and whatever we are is enough, and that's who we are. And uh, believe in yourself, and never forget, I think that's what tonight is about, never forget to always try and help others, you know? Often, oftentimes it's something which is the last thing on our minds and it's the last thing we do, but really helping someone in need, I think, is something we all can do a little bit more. Katrina, what do you want to say about Indian cricket team? They have played very well and now they have been, uh, they have been in the semi-finals with West Indies. So any message for them? Uh, yes, super congratulations and I uh, hope them continued success and um, all the best. Thank you.